Hi, I'm Larry O'Brien, geologist. We're out today on the top of Trilobite Ridge in Port Jervis, New York. It's well above sea level right now. But you know, the climate has changed on this planet over the millions of years. Let's take a look at the rocks and see what they can tell us about climate change. Here's one right here. We can break it open and take a look at what we find inside it. There's some interesting little curly patterns in here. Let me show you one that's a little better. Right? Uh, this one. Can you see here in the sunlight this little shape going like that? There's a larger piece of the same thing. There it is. That's the tail of a trilobite. Trilobites are extinct now, but they lived back in Silurian Devonian time, 350 million years ago, 400 million years ago, in an ocean bottom. This rock had to have been deposited in an ocean bottom. These critters don't live on land, they're sea critters. Now we find tails of them, but sometimes when you break the rocks open, like this, you can find a head. And you can see the bumpy head. Now this head doesn't go with this tail. This is called Dalmanites, and this head is a fake hop's head. So there were at least two different species of trilobites living in the ocean bottom back 350 million years ago in this area. Sometimes in the rocks, you can find both of them together. For instance, in this one, you can see portion of a tail right here and portion of a head right next to it. It means there's been vast changes over the millions of years of Earth history from an ocean bottom which extended from where we are here in Port Jervis clear west to where the present Pacific Ocean is, all ocean. And now that's changed and we're on dry land. Environmental changes are the normal state of affairs on this planet. As a matter of fact, this ridge, trilobite ridge that we're on, wouldn't be so well exposed for us to find the trilobites had it not been for the glaciers that covered this area. Now that's not back hundreds of millions in the past. That was maybe about 10,000 years ago when the ice scraped down these valleys and across these mountain ridges, scoured off the overlying rocks, and exposed these now extinct sea creatures to let us see about the environmental change that's taken place in this area.